And we're back here with FM Manager 2023. This is uh, the McLaren Career 2025 season, season number three. We're at Monaco for the Monaco Grand Prix. Qualifying results. Signs out of the pole. We're stabbing second, Lando qualified third, Russell fourth, K-Mag fifth. We're going to put K-Mag on a two-stop strategy to try something a little bit different, maybe a little bit special. It is uh, about... 10 seconds faster than the one stop so we're gonna put Lando on the one stop uh, everything ready to go we head on down the track and get this Monaco Grand Prix underway the streets of Monte Carlo. Let's try, this race is mainly about qualifying good you get a good qualifying position you can usually have a good finish and it's lights out, and away, away we, we go. go. Here as balances for both, of course, and high overtake aggression. Come on, Lando, get by Max. Get by Max. Get by Max. Damn it. Come on, Lando. How have you already fallen a second behind Max? How the hell did you already fall a second behind him? Oh my god. Come on, man, don't run him back down, baby. We're stepping on soft tires. All right, well, that kind of makes sense. Well, we're almost two seconds back now, so we're just going to slow everything down a little bit. We're stepping all over Carl Sainz, George. Right with Lando. K Mag staying in front of Alcon. Who's on hard tires? Valtteri's on mediums, Albon on soft, McLaren on soft. I don't know, I really don't know how the hell they're snapping and trying to pull away from Lando so damn bad. Lando push for a little bit. Maybe he can break DRS on George Russell. Almost. And now he has broken DRS on George. Okay, man, run him down.
maybe drop back a little bit, please. Let Magnus just save on his tires just a little bit. Increase pushing status. Confirm. Ain't no damn way. Uh, Try to take care of these tires. Yeah, confirm. I'll call this round K-Mag, damn it. Try to look after the tires. Cool. Magnuson is about to fall behind Valky. God, it's a nice, son. Come on, Magnuson, shit. Lando doing a really, really good job on his tires. Down to fourteen. Alphatory cars. Her staffing made it stop. Her staffing with the soft tires. That means you're gonna be doing a two stop strategy. Oh my goodness. Stafford is still two seconds behind George Russell.
Box now. Box. Yeah, confirm. Yeah, confirm. Land the plane. Copy. And good stop for Lando. Lando comes out ahead of his teammates, so he's in great shape. We'll even post on this lap. Call the signs in. Verstappen gets around him. And Lando comes out. Hold on to your pit stop issue. So Alfa Romeo's crew are out. Hang on, there's an issue with the rear left tire. Wow, the left rear really have problems. Lando is right with Carlos Sun. We know Max has to stop again, so. So we'll hand over to use ERS right now. Get around Carlos Sainz. Come on, Lando. Get around him. Come on, Lando. Get around him. God dang it, boy. Second behind. Yep, confirmed. Ah, oh, damn it, man! I'm gonna get stuck behind all kinds. Son of a bitch. Continue like this. Oh, I can't hold this up. Uh, temperatures are going uh, slightly up. Yeah, God damn it. You've got to get around him, Lando. God damn. Finally. That way you can fucking pass Max when he fucking stops. K-Max tires are in good shape. Oh, I can't hit fit lane now. Comes out in tenth behind Valtteri Bottas. We need you to increase lift and coast. Confirm. Charge button on. Yes. Yeah, Lando taking gold.
give it all you got. Copy. Hey man, push on this lap and you're stopping. Put his hard tires on. Yeah, we are boxing this lap. Folks, box. Lando's only nine seconds behind Max. Sergio Perez has a pit stop issue. The Williams team take their places. But they run into trouble and it holds up their stop. And the right front has problems. They have problems with the right front of Perez's car. Stappen's in there. Russell's in. Magnuson's in. Max comes out 12 seconds back. Copy that. Watch the line up at exit. K-Mag falls all the way to the 11th. That's only the soft tires. Wow. Nick DeVries with the fastest lap. And K Magnolia gets the top 10. Up to night. He has eyes set on the Valtteri now. Plenty of tires we can push. Elbow hits the pit lane. And came back and gets around Valtteri for seven. Lando is starting to run down Carlos Sainz. Hey man, gets around the clan for six. And now he's got Alcon in his sights for fifth. And he will make the pass on Archon for fifth. Wow. Great job, K Mag, man. And he's pulled away from Archon. Lando starting to run down Carlos Sainz. No lift off needed. You are doing a good job. Charge on. Go for And charge button off. Go for Now how in the hell is that catch Lando that damn quick? There's no damn way that Max caught him that damn quick. Tempting. 
I'm sure Lando could still get third. I hell with it. Push him back right there. Let Lando and push wide and the hell open. Push. Not dumb enough with the RS. Yeah, I'm good. Just look after these tires. Confirm. He has 24 seconds ahead of his teammate. I don't think he's gonna be able to run him down. And box now, box. Yeah, confirm. Land the fillet. Okay, good. has a delayed pit stop. Charge button off, charge button off. Yeah, come, come. Lando push wide open on this lap. Get the fastest lap. I mean, he's almost ran George down already. An increased lift and coast. Confirm. Lando only two seconds behind George Russell. Come on, Lando, get around him already. Get around him, god dang it. Are you kidding me, Lando? Are you for real not going to go around him? Oh, my God. This is stupid. He could have... He could have ran these guys down.
His last lap, he was two seconds faster than Carlos Sainz. He can still get there and get second. Two laps to go. Two laps to go. He is within a second of Carlos Sainz now. And there's no lap traffic in front of us. second place. Hell yes. Lando moves up to second with the fastest lap. And he has pulled away from Carlos Sainz. He's going to check out. Hell yes, Lando. Great job, baby. Great job. Great drive. And K-Mag has used up his tires. And Max Verstappen wins Monaco. Good job, Lando. Great job, baby. And Come back and finish second. Hell yeah. There wasn't a chance. See, I don't think there was a chance we were going to get second if I had to put the soft tires on him. Making that extra stop, putting the soft tires on him, helping him get second. What an achievement! Sometimes you take the incredible skill of these drivers for granted, but not today. The top three starters finishing in the top three, but in a different yeah, order. It's disabled. Copy. K Man comes home fifth. Okay, uh, that's the checker flex. Valtteri trying to hang on to seven ahead of Albon. Awesome job, mate. That was a solid race, especially first stint. Will be Albon, will be Bottas in seventh. And Valtteri's going to hang on. Can Gasly hold off Ricardo for Kent? Ricardo trying to score his first points of the season. And he's not going to, he's not going to get there. We're going just short. Wow. Good job, Lando. Great job, baby. He loses a little bit of ground to Mac, but not much. The McLaren driver put in a great performance today. Definitely a well-deserved podium. You've got to say, their race strategy was very good indeed. A great display of team spirit there, as everyone finally gets the chance to share this moment. Lando Norris certainly loves a podium, heading up there now to celebrate again. Lando is only driving with a podium. seem like it's getting old for them, but they've worked hard for it. Only driving with a podium in every single race this season. Always a special occasion here in the incomparable Monte Carlo. They'll be pushing the boat out here tonight, no doubt. Yeah, well, Max said, you know, Max first win of the season. Leclerc had two wins. First win of the season for Max, and it took seven races. Now, Karun, with that result in mind, what would they be feeling like down at McLaren? A great feeling. They'd certainly be pleased to have made the podium. A job well done, for sure. Both drivers in the top five? Hell yeah. And thank you everyone for joining us this weekend here in Monaco. Formula One will be back to Europe for the next round Spain, on the shores of the Mediterranean with some heated competition to look forward to in Spain. Yep. Lando still leads by 25 points over Max. 
Leclerc is now 49 back. The constructors, we gained two more points on Red Bull. We're 18 ahead of Ferrari now. Five times we've had the fastest lap. Red Bull's had one and Ferrari's had the other. The pole have been by the top three teams, Ferrari, McLaren, and Red Bull. Same with the wins. Ferrari has one win, McLaren has three, Red Bull has three. Leclerc with the fastest pit stop. Verstappen third. Ferrari had fourth. And we did not have one inside the top ten. Not good. Haas finally had one in the top ten. So we lose out big time to Ferrari and Red Bull now. Lando had a bad pit stop. A good two seconds, so he might have had a chance to win the damn race had he not had that bad pit stop. Lando, another great weekend. Again, another good one for K Mag. K Mag, so it works out perfect. Clement Oblak wins the F2 race. Paul Aaron third, Roman Stenick, I mean, Paul Aaron second, Roman Stenick third. F3, Oliver Gray, Murray Boa, and Kaylin Frederick. One of our sponsors asked if we could reduce the number of factory events, so we had a schedule event. Reduce the overall amount of sponsorship funding we received this season, but we were getting those manufacturing days back to support car park development. Yeah, it can't be too much money. Brand new underfloor coming on the car for Spain. I definitely need to make another side pod. Oh, we've already got one mate coming. Okay. And I believe that would give us two on everything, right? Except for the underfloor. I'm not worried about the underfloor because we'll, we'll probably gonna have to emergency manufacture two of them. design of the car part until the CFD simulator gets completed because it's going to help out. Now the floor is complete. Tripod manufactured. CFD simulator is complete. Refurbished. Four years left on that contract. 
Damn. Emerging manufacturer two is three point two million. Approximately 30 days left until the design and research period resets. So, it means all three of these will be coming through, so we will need to keep some of that. tunnel really doesn't help the front wing at all. So it's point zero one three, we're moving up to eight. That's what every day. Forty-three days. So I think we can get it for Showerstone. Oh, just after Showerstone, but we can get it for Hungry, which is a medium-speed corner track, medium and high speed. 
or it's actually, I mean, a, a low, no, it's a low and medium speed track. Really need to get Lando a new ERS. This money ain't bad. 75 coins, 77 braking, 69 reaction, 75 accuracy, 76 control, 72 on smooth. That's not the best, but it's not horrible. Seen a lot worse. Adaptability's pretty decent, considering he's that young. 70 overtaking, 76 defending. But he is already 24 years old. Hmm. What kind of weather are we going to have in Spain? Rain? Oh, it's cloudy. It's cloudy. Alright. Car analysis. We want to look at Lando's car. Oof. 11 and 12. Well, mm. Mercedes just ahead of us. Red Bull. So, Verstappen's going to be difficult at this track. Aston Martin shouldn't be a problem. Max and Ferrari. I mean, Red Bull and Ferrari are going to be the problem. Uh oh, wait a minute. It looks like they gave Max some upgrades, but not Leclerc. Claire's top speed is better than Max's. That's it. We might have trouble getting around Max and Claire. Point zero three seven behind Ferrari. How much are we behind Max? Oof. Point zero six. 
He's almost point zero three ahead of Ferrari himself. Uh, Leclerc's uh, not quite point zero point zero five, but it's close. Uh, I guess it ain't too bad. Uh, well, wait a minute. I didn't even throw the damn underfoot on the car. Now let's look at it. Uh, tent, nice and tent. Point zero four four behind Max. Point zero three one behind Leclerc. And only point zero one six behind Ferrari. Uh, not bad. Our top speed is not quite there, but and our dirty air tolerance is horrible. Ferrari has the best. Red Bull fifth. Blows down to the qualifying top 10 easily. Yeah, wait, I'm gonna put it down fast and flat. And that will do it for now. Thank you for watching. You know what to do. Come back. We'll be racing around it. But again, uh, Circuit de Barcelona, Catalonia. And the Spanish Grand Prix. Hope everyone has a wonderful day. I will see y'all next time.